The House of Braganza, emerging from the town of Braganza in Portugal, stands as a prominent royal dynasty with a rich legacy spanning centuries. In this exploration, we delve into 101 specific facts encapsulating the Braganza's journey, from their humble beginnings to their enduring impact on Portuguese history, global exploration, cultural advancement, and diplomatic engagements. 1. Origins in Braganza The House of Braganza traces its roots to the town of Braganza in northeastern Portugal, where its founders held the title of Dukes. 2. Afonso, first Duke, Afonso, the first Duke of Braganza, rose to prominence through his marriage to the natural daughter of King John Bram of Portugal, catapulting the family into royal circles. 3. Rise to power. The Braganzas steadily ascended the social and political hierarchy, gaining influence and wealth through strategic alliances and advantageous marriages. 4. Dynastic feud. The rivalry between the Braganzas and the ruling Aviz dynasty intensified as they vied for power and legitimacy, leading to political intrigue and conflict. 5. Jones II's grant. Jones II of Portugal granted the dukedom of Braganza to Afonso, solidifying the family's status and importance within the kingdom. 6. Pedro, first Duke of Coimbra. Pedro, the first Duke of Coimbra and brother of King Afonso V, played a pivotal role in Braganza's early rise, leveraging his familial connections to advance the family's interests. 7. Strategic Alliances The Braganzas strategically allied themselves with other noble houses, forming powerful coalitions to consolidate their influence and protect their territories. 8. Portuguese Restoration War John IV, a member of the House of Braganza, spearheaded the Portuguese Restoration War against Spanish rule, reclaiming Portugal's independence in 1640. 9. Independence Proclamation John IV's proclamation of Portuguese independence marked a turning point in the nation's history, ending over six decades of Spanish dominance and reaffirming Portugal's sovereignty. 10. Royal Marriage Catherine of Braganza, daughter of John IV, married King Charles II of England in 1662, cementing ties between the Braganzas and the English monarchy. 11. Global Expansion the Braganzas presided over Portugal's expansion into new territories, establishing colonies in Brazil, Africa, India, and Southeast Asia, and contributing to the growth of the Portuguese Empire. 12. Legacy of Exploration Under Braganza rule, Portuguese explorers like Vasco da Gama and Pedro Álvarez Cabral pioneered maritime exploration, opening up new trade routes and expanding Portugal's influence around the globe. 13 cultural patronage. The Braganzas were enthusiastic patrons of the arts and sciences, fostering a vibrant cultural scene in Portugal and attracting talented artists, writers, and scholars to their court. 14. Architectural splendor. The Braganzas commissioned the construction of magnificent palaces, churches, and public buildings, leaving behind a legacy of architectural splendor that still dazzles visitors today. 15. Military triumphs. The Braganzas achieved significant military victories, defending Portugal from foreign invasions and securing the nation's borders against aggressors. 16. Reign of Afonso VI Afonso VII's reign saw both triumphs and challenges, including victories over Spain in the Restoration War and conflicts with powerful nobles vying for control of the throne. 17. Afonso VI's abdication Afonso II's abdication in favor of his brother Pedro II marked a tumultuous period in Braganza history, with competing factions vying for control of the kingdom. 18. Pedro II's Rule Pedro II's reign was characterized by stability and prosperity as he implemented reforms to strengthen Portugal's economy and institutions. 19. Expansion of Trade the Braganzas promoted trade and commerce, fostering economic growth and prosperity through the expansion of Portugal's overseas trade networks. 20. Cultural Renaissance The Braganzas presided over a cultural renaissance in Portugal, nurturing the talents of artists, writers, and musicians who flourished under their patronage. 21. 
scientific innovation. Braganza supported scientific research and innovation, funding expeditions to study natural history, astronomy and navigation, and contributing to Portugal's reputation as a center of learning. 22. Educational Reforms The Braganzas implemented educational reforms, expanding access to schooling and promoting literacy and learning among the Portuguese population. 23. Religious Tolerance The Braganzas promoted religious tolerance and coexistence, fostering a climate of religious freedom that attracted immigrants and refugees from across Europe. 24. Diplomatic Skill the Braganzas were skilled diplomats, negotiating treaties and alliances to protect Portugal's interests and maintain peace with neighboring powers. 25. Family Dynasties The Braganzas intermarried with other European royal houses, forging alliances and strengthening ties with monarchs and nobles across the continent. 26. Colonial Administration The Braganzas oversaw the administration of Portugal's overseas territories, implementing policies to govern the colonies and exploit their natural resources. 27. Scientific Expeditions The Braganzas sponsored scientific expeditions to explore and map Portugal's overseas territories, contributing to the advancement of geographical knowledge and cartography. 28. Cultural Exchange The Braganzas promoted cultural exchange between Portugal and its colonies, facilitating the exchange of ideas, languages, and customs across continents. 29. Naval Power The Braganzas invested in the Portuguese Navy, building a formidable fleet to protect Portugal's maritime interests and project power abroad. 30. Legacy of Exploration The Braganzas' legacy of exploration and discovery inspired future generations of Portuguese navigators and explorers who continued to push the boundaries of geographical knowledge. 31. Diplomatic Alliances The Braganzas formed strategic alliances with other European powers, including England, France, and the Netherlands, to counterbalance the influence of Spain and maintain Portugal's independence. 32. Cultural Patronage The Braganzas patronized the arts and humanities, supporting painters, sculptors, poets and playwrights who contributed to Portugal's cultural richness and diversity. 33. Educational Institutions The Braganzas founded schools, colleges and universities to promote learning and scholarship, laying the foundations for Portugal's educational system. 34. Religious Institutions The Braganzas supported the Catholic Church, funding the construction of churches, monasteries and convents throughout Portugal and its colonies. 35. Charitable Endeavors The Braganzas were renowned for their philanthropy, endowing charitable institutions and supporting the poor, the sick, and the needy through acts of generosity and compassion. 36. Legacies of Exploration The Braganzas' legacy of exploration and colonization left a lasting imprint on the cultures, languages, and societies of the territories they conquered and governed. 37. Royal Consorts The Braganzas' royal consorts played influential roles in shaping the dynasty's fortunes, serving as advisors, confidants, and diplomats in their own right. 38. Military Leadership The Braganzas were skilled military leaders, commanding armies in defense of Portugal's territories and waging wars against foreign aggressors to protect the kingdom's independence. 39. Political Intrigue the Braganzas navigated a complex web of political intrigue and dynastic rivalries, forging alliances and outmaneuvering their adversaries to maintain their grip on power. 40. Cultural Renaissance The Braganzas presided over a golden age of Portuguese culture, fostering artistic and intellectual achievements that earned Portugal recognition as a center of European civilization. 41. Trade Routes the Braganzas expanded Portugal's trade routes, establishing lucrative networks of commerce that enriched the kingdom and fueled its economic growth. 42. Exploration Expeditions The Braganzas sponsored expeditions of exploration and discovery, sending navigators and cartographers to map uncharted territories and claim new lands for Portugal. 
1943. Colonial Governance The Braganzas implemented policies of colonial governance, overseeing the administration of Portugal's overseas territories and promoting the exploitation of their natural resources. 44. Military Conquests The Braganzas achieved military conquests in Africa, Asia and the Americas, expanding Portugal's territorial holdings and extending the reach of the Portuguese Empire. 45. Cultural Fusion The Braganzas fostered a spirit of cultural fusion and exchange, blending Portuguese traditions with those of the peoples they encountered in their overseas colonies. 46. Scientific Innovation The Braganzas supported scientific innovation and exploration, funding research expeditions and establishing scientific institutions to study the natural world. 47. Religious Toleration The Braganzas promoted religious toleration and coexistence, allowing for the free practice of diverse faiths within Portugal's borders. 48. Artistic Patronage The Braganzas patronized the arts, commissioning works of painting, sculpture and architecture that adorned their palaces and public buildings. 49. Educational Enlightenment The Braganzas promoted educational enlightenment, encouraging the pursuit of knowledge and the advancement of learning among the Portuguese people. 50. Humanitarian Endeavors The Braganzas engaged in humanitarian endeavors, providing aid and assistance to those in need and advocating for the rights and welfare of the less fortunate. 51. Maritime Dominance The Braganzas solidified Portugal's status as a maritime power, establishing control over key trade routes and dominating global commerce during the Age of Exploration. 52. Nuno Álvarez Pereira Nuno Álvarez Pereira, a revered military commander and member of the Braganza family, played a crucial role in defending Portugal against Spanish invasion during the 14th century. 53. Influence in the Church The Braganzas wielded significant influence within the Catholic Church, with several family members holding high-ranking ecclesiastical positions and shaping religious policy in Portugal. 54. José Brissiú's Enlightenment Policies José Bramán of Portugal, a Braganza monarch, implemented Enlightenment-inspired reforms aimed at modernizing Portugal's economy, education system, and government institutions. 55. Pombaline Reforms The Marquis of Pombal, a prominent member of the Braganza court, initiated sweeping administrative and economic reforms that transformed Portugal into a more efficient and centralized state. 56. Treaty of Windsor The Treaty of Windsor, signed between Portugal and England in 1386, established a long-lasting alliance between the two countries, with the Braganzas playing a key role in its negotiation and ratification. 57. Influence in Brazil The Braganzas oversaw the colonization and development of Brazil, Portugal's largest and most prosperous colony, leaving a lasting imprint on the country's culture, society, and governance. 58. João VII's flight to Brazil During the Napoleonic Wars, João VI of Portugal, a member of the Braganza dynasty, fled to Brazil, transforming Rio de Janeiro into the de facto capital of the Portuguese Empire and fostering closer ties between Portugal and its South American colony. 59. Queen Maria II's reign, Maria Secu of Portugal, the first queen regnant of the Braganza dynasty, ruled during a period of political turmoil and constitutional reform, guiding Portugal towards a more democratic and liberal form of government. 60. Queen Maria Rawin's mental illness. Maria Warwan of Portugal, also known as Maria the Mad, struggled with mental illness during her reign, leading to periods of instability and political upheaval within the Braganza dynasty. 61. Legacy of Vasco da Gama. Vasco da Gama, a renowned Portuguese explorer and navigator sponsored by the Braganzas, discovered a sea route to India in 1498, opening up lucrative trade opportunities and expanding Portugal's global influence. 62. Pedro V's abdication. Pedro IV of Portugal, also known as Pedro Barome of Brazil, abdicated the Portuguese throne in favor of his daughter Maria Sequeno, opting to rule as Emperor of Brazil instead, 
a move that signaled the end of Portuguese colonial rule in South America. 63. Legacy of Infante Henrique Infante Henrique, also known as Henry the Navigator, was a member of the Braganza family who played a pivotal role in advancing Portugal's maritime exploration and overseas expansion, earning him the title of Father of the Age of Discovery. 64. Afonso Henriques's Independence Afonso Vespas of Portugal, also known as Afonso Henriques, the founder of the Portuguese kingdom and ancestor of the Braganza dynasty, successfully fought for independence from the Kingdom of Leon in the 12th century, establishing Portugal as a sovereign nation. 65. Cultural Exchange with Asia The Braganzas facilitated cultural exchange between Portugal and Asia through trade, diplomacy, and missionary activities, leading to the blending of European and Asian influences in art, architecture, and cuisine. 66. Pedro V's Progressive Policies Pedro V of Portugal, a progressive monarch from the Braganza dynasty, championed social reforms, public health initiatives, and educational improvements aimed at modernizing Portuguese society and uplifting its citizens. 67. D. Filipa de Lancastre. Filipa de Lancastre, an English princess and member of the Braganza family, played a pivotal role in cementing ties between Portugal and England through her marriage to King João Rudd, forging a lasting Anglo-Portuguese alliance. 68. Vasco da Gama's Exploration. Vasco da Gama, sponsored by the Braganzas, embarked on a historic voyage around the Cape of Good Hope to India in 1497 to 1499, opening up a direct sea route to Asia and revolutionizing global trade. 69. Pedro VII's support for independence movements. Pedro IV of Portugal, a liberal monarch sympathetic to nationalist movements, supported independence movements in Brazil and Greece, contributing to the dissolution of Portuguese colonial rule and the spread of democracy. 70. Influence of Queen Carlota Joaquina. Carlota Joaquina of Spain, consort of King João VI of Portugal, wielded considerable political influence within the Braganza court, often intervening in affairs of state and diplomacy to advance her own interests. 71. Diplomatic successes. The Braganzas achieved diplomatic successes on the international stage, negotiating treaties and alliances that bolstered Portugal's security, expanded its territorial holdings, and enhanced its standing among European powers. 72. Pedro II's Patronage of the Arts. Pedro II of Portugal, a cultured monarch with a keen appreciation for the arts, patronized painters, sculptors, and musicians, transforming Lisbon into a center of artistic creativity and cultural innovation. 73. Marriage Alliances. The Braganzas formed strategic marriage alliances with other European royal houses, strengthening diplomatic ties securing dynastic succession rights for future generations of Portuguese monarchs. 74. Legacy of Bartolomeu Dias. Bartolomeu Dias, sponsored by the Braganzas, became the first European explorer to round the southern tip of Africa, opening up a sea route to the Indian Ocean and laying the groundwork for Portugal's future maritime dominance. 75. Queen Maria II's Constitutional Monarchy. Maria II of Portugal promulgated Portugal's first modern constitution in 1826, establishing a constitutional monarchy and laying the groundwork for representative government and the rule of law. 76. Cultural Renaissance in Lisbon The Braganzas presided over a cultural renaissance in Lisbon, transforming the city into a vibrant center of intellectual, artistic and scientific activity that attracted scholars, artists, and thinkers from across Europe. 77. Legacy of Gil Eanes. Gil Eanes, a Portuguese navigator sponsored by the Braganzas, successfully navigated Cape Bojador in 1434, breaking the psychological barrier to exploration of the West African coast, and paving the way for further maritime discoveries. 78. Joan the Force patronage of music. Joan IV of Portugal, an accomplished musician and composer himself, 
patronized composers such as João Lorenzo Rebelo and Estevão de Brito, fostering a golden age of Portuguese music known as the João IV period. 79. Educational reforms under João III. João III of Portugal, a member of the Braganza dynasty, implemented educational reforms aimed at expanding access to schooling and promoting the spread of humanist learning and scientific knowledge throughout Portugal. 80. Exploration of the Azores. The Braganzas sponsored expeditions to explore and colonize the Azores archipelago, strategically located in the Atlantic Ocean, establishing Portuguese settlements and fortifications that played a crucial role in protecting Portugal's maritime interests. 81. Legacy of Diogo Cão. Diogo Cão, sponsored by the Braganzas, explored the coast of West Africa in the late 15th century, discovering the Congo River and reaching as far south as present-day Angola, opening up new trade routes and establishing Portuguese presence in the region. 82. Pedro II's modernization efforts. Pedro II of Portugal initiated modernization efforts aimed at industrializing Portugal and improving its infrastructure investing in railroads, factories, and public works projects to stimulate economic growth and development. 83. Cultural Exchange with Africa The Braganzas facilitated cultural exchange between Portugal and its African colonies, introducing European technologies, languages, and customs, while also adopting elements of African culture and tradition into Portuguese society. 84. Exploration of the Indian Ocean the Braganzas sponsored expeditions to explore and establish trade relations with countries bordering the Indian Ocean, including India, Sri Lanka, and Indonesia, expanding Portugal's commercial network and enhancing its global influence. 85. Legacy of Tristão da Cunha Tristão da Cunha, sponsored by the Braganzas, discovered the remote islands that bear his name in the South Atlantic Ocean in the early 16th century establishing Portuguese claims to the territory and providing a crucial resupply point for Portuguese ships sailing to and from Asia. 86. Expansion into North Africa. The Braganzas expanded Portuguese influence into North Africa, establishing trading posts and fortifications along the coast of Morocco and the Mediterranean, securing Portugal's position as a major player in the geopolitics of the region. 87. Maritime Expeditions to the Spice Islands The Braganzas sponsored expeditions to the Spice Islands, present-day Indonesia, seeking to establish control over the lucrative spice trade and extend Portuguese influence into Southeast Asia, laying the groundwork for future colonial ventures in the region. 88. Legacy of Fernão de Magalhães Fernão de Magalhães, sponsored by the Braganzas, led the first expedition to circumnavigate the globe in the early 16th century, opening up new trade routes and expanding European knowledge of the world's geography. 89. Cultural influence in Macau. The Braganzas established a thriving Portuguese colony in Macau, China, fostering cultural exchange and trade between East and West, and leaving behind a rich architectural and culinary legacy that still endures today. 90. Exploration of the Pacific Ocean The Braganzas sponsored expeditions to explore the Pacific Ocean, discovering new islands and territories in the region, and establishing Portuguese claims to vast expanses of ocean and coastline, contributing to Portugal's status as a global maritime power. 91. Influence of Infanta Isabel Infanta Isabel of Portugal, daughter of King Manuel Bermont and member of the Braganza family, played a crucial role in securing Portugal's alliance with Spain through her marriage to King Charles V, helping to stabilize relations between the two countries and prevent further conflict. 92. Diplomatic Negotiations with the Ottoman Empire The Braganzas engaged in diplomatic negotiations with the Ottoman Empire, seeking to secure trade concessions and establish peaceful relations between Portugal and the powerful Islamic State paving the way for future economic and cultural exchanges. 93. Legacy of Gil Eanes Gil Eanes, sponsored by the Braganzas, successfully navigated Cape Bojador in 1434, 
breaking the psychological barrier to exploration of the West African coast and paving the way for further maritime discoveries. 94. Juan the First Patronage of Music. Juan the Fourth of Portugal, an accomplished musician and composer himself, patronized composers such as Juan Lorenzo Ravello and Estevão de Brito, fostering a golden age of Portuguese music known as the João Fortre period. 95. Educational reforms under João III. João III of Portugal, a member of the Braganza dynasty, implemented educational reforms aimed at expanding access to schooling and promoting the spread of humanist learning and scientific knowledge throughout Portugal. 96. Exploration of the Azores. The Braganzas sponsored expeditions to explore and colonize the Azores archipelago, strategically located in the Atlantic Ocean, establishing Portuguese settlements and fortifications that played a crucial role in protecting Portugal's maritime interests. 97. Legacy of Diogo Cão. Diogo Cão, sponsored by the Braganzas, explored the coast of West Africa in the late 15th century, discovering the Congo River and reaching as far south as present-day Angola, opening up new trade routes and establishing Portuguese presence in the region. 98. Pedro II's Modernization Efforts Pedro II of Portugal initiated modernization efforts aimed at industrializing Portugal and improving its infrastructure, investing in railroads, factories, and public works projects to stimulate economic growth and development. 99. Cultural Exchange with Africa The Braganzas facilitated cultural exchange between Portugal and its African colonies, introducing European technologies, languages, and customs, while also adopting elements of African culture and tradition into Portuguese society. 100. Exploration of the Indian Ocean the Braganzas sponsored expeditions to explore and establish trade relations with countries bordering the Indian Ocean, including India, Sri Lanka, and Indonesia, expanding Portugal's commercial network and enhancing its global influence. 101. Legacy of Tristão da Cunha Tristão da Cunha, sponsored by the Braganzas, discovered the remote islands that bear his name in the South Atlantic Ocean in the early 16th century establishing Portuguese claims to the territory and providing a crucial resupply point for Portuguese ships sailing to and from Asia. Thanks for watching History Enthusiasts and don't forget to like and subscribe.